live event? Why, yes. And let's just assume that it's now started, because I don't get much feedback over here. Okay, well, Storm Dane Productions, live boredom, of course. Uh, today we will be unboxing and playing the Oya. Or Ouya. I'm going to call it Oya. You can uh, correct me later. What you see here is actually the box that it came in. Uh, what happened was uh, I was working on the God of War 3, well, God of War uh, Anthology Part 3 video, and when this thing came, and I had to force myself not to open it because I knew if I did, I would not get, <laughs> not get the uh, video done. So let me bring this over to the uh, YouTube channel, my YouTube channel, so I can see comments. Right now, I um, mean, I'm going to switch the camera view. Uh, right now I have this uh, on a Ikea <laughs> a drawer table thing, which, would, yeah, got checks and stuff and like a Netflix thing in here. Imagine the video quality on this is very bad, but i um, kind of working with uh, short notice of equipment breaking, namely my headphones. That thing. Headphones I've had for years and years and years, busted by the dog yesterday. Don't you just love pets? Not my channel that it went to. I'm going to the channel so I can see comments of, oh, yo, I can't hear you. Oh, wait a minute. Is this... Oh, it's a little bit different. I'm going to go to the... Oh, yeah, then. Got five watching. Uh, let's go to the actual video of it. I got spyware on this laptop. This laptop you can't see right here. That's an ad right there. I got spyware because there's ads all over the sides and top of this, uh, this view. Uh, now I got a, a fake, uh, a fake Facebook thing going on. I just want to make sure that people are making comments. Should the comments here? Yeah. Well, it's loading. Show more. So I think, uh, I'm just gonna get right into it because I think we've had enough boredom for this live boredom. I just hope that the audio is working. Okay, I can hear myself, so that's good. F5 on that. I'm going to move the camera now, so there's going to be a lot of uh, fluctuation in audio here. I just have the TV behind me, uh, computer's running, of course, got to have the computer running to do an actual uh, live stream. And so that's where most of our anguish comes from uh, with the audio. The headphones right there, yeah, they don't work. Oh, there's all sorts of stuff, incriminating stuff over there. Let's not do that. Oh, look, you can actually see the side panel of the computer. What a travesty. Avoided that for a long time. I'm not getting any comments here. Please comment if you're around. <coughs> and of course we have more live boredom. Um, let's get a video manager. Alright, cutting device, it's just scissors. I mean, I don't think I've got a whole lot of uh, cutting stuff. I, I think I've used keys before for uh, cutting open tape. Let's get the sides first. Now we're, we're unboxing the box right now, so yeah, that's that's very interesting. But I, I like I said before, I stopped myself from opening up the package so I could actually finish a video, an 18-minute video. Oh, I gotta get this across here. So oh, let's do this when I worked at a gas station. Oh, God. Okay, well, since then I've Growing weak because I work in an office now. Okay. Oh, that should help. Oh, they got a cross. Cross tape. Now, I've never really done an unboxing before the, uh, for the Wii U video that I did. Of course, I'm doing this one solo. <coughs> and, uh, my thoughts really with this is that, uh, you know, I, it's, you see many, many unboxing videos on YouTube. And my big beef is moving cameras or just sort of like, oh, here, you know, is the object here, you know. Uh, this is the best I think I can do with, uh, with my equipment. 
Oh, wow, we do have some uh, comments. Or those look like... Those look a little bit old. Uh, slime power, poop. Oh, that one was removed, I thought. Okay. Enigma Extreme. I had to drive to the airport to pick up mine. Dang, man. And uh, you said that you're staying up for this one. Correct me if I'm wrong, Nick, but... Uh, <laughs> I, I really do not want to be wrong about this, but are you in Australia? Because if you are, then it's like 4 or 5 in the morning there, and that's what I'm judging. Everybody, check out Enigma uh, Extreme. I like his videos. Oh, here's so yeah. I didn't really watch any unboxing videos myself. Um, so, but I saw like this on the thumbnail. So here we are. How many people in the comments have... Uh, how about this himself? Wow. Oh, dude, we got a lot of, a lot more comments now. Uh, audio is fine. Awesome. Says the extreme. Clyde says it's, uh, it's working. Something 631. Hi. And Enigma says, raise his hand present. All right. These things are usually just peeled back. So it's, it's a sliding case that's going to come out like that. Honestly, I don't like unboxing videos, and maybe it's because what uh, I've seen, which the, which is the moving camera, or you know, trying to hold the object with one hand and operate a camera with the uh, other hand, you know, it uh, sucks. I'm gonna have to hit F5 to refresh these comments. Thank you for believing. Let's see, can you see that? I'm looking back at my computer here. Um, wow, this is gonna be a really sucky way of looking at comments. Okay, guys, so I'm just going to leave comments alone. Thank you for believing. Oh! For some reason, I thought I was going to come with two controllers, but of course, I didn't order a second one. What's on the back of this? Uh, no, thank you for believing. Hmm. Oh, this might make, make a neat prop. Let me put it over here. Uh, oh, off camera where you can't see it, but I'm putting it on the uh, previewing television. And by the way, yes, it is hot as hell in this room heat wave across the western United States. I have my glass of water here for, uh, <laughs> well, for me. Okay. So, we have the controller. Ooh. The initial impressions, like, two seconds after picking it up. A little bit heavy. Well, I mean, no, that, that's just an initial impression. Let's get another one over here. Uh, I had the, uh, I was working with the OnLive controller the other day. Yeah, OnLive one's heavy. Then it becomes apparent, because I really don't know how this is going to go. I don't know really of any games that are for the, uh... Oh, yeah. Let's see. Here's one that you guys have never seen in a video, but, you know, I don't know. Cost some shockwave. Wii U Controller Pro... I, I forget what it's called. Heavier than the Wii U. All right. But, uh, let's see how it feels in the hand. It... Works. I'm going to just take all this stuff off right now. It's uh, meant to keep it all shiny. Ah, it's stuck on my hand. Well, not that it would be a crime to uh, go the rest of the video with it on hand. Oh, I just tore it. Come on. Oh, I, sorry, I took it off camera. I took it closer to my face here. All right, that's a big shiny back end there. Um, sorry, I'm taking this thing off camera to take this off. Uh, I'm guessing the uh, battery pack is internal. I don't see any ports for it right now. Uh, I'll let you know I didn't do a whole lot of research on the uh, OEM before purchasing, really. Uh, oh, wait. Oh, those look like pieces of tape. Uh, let's just get those off, too. Yeah, it looks really like scotch tape. Uh, to hold the controller together. Get that off. All right. Just gonna fiddle with this. So what we have on the controller, it's been around for you guys. There's two sticks, of course. It, they click. Um, I think it's a 360 controller. I got one around here. I got just drawers. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. So it is most similar because of stick configurations to 360. Comparable in size, too. 
So we got the D-pad. It's one of those sucky ones that uh, uh, I guess the Xbox is fixing. Microsoft is fixing, rather, with their next Xbox. You know, the tape can just stay on that one here. Um, oh, no, I'm wrong. No, no, it's actually independent. I thought it was one of these rolling ones, and they suck. So uh, these things click, too. We've got a center button. You know, I guess that's the symbol for the... Uh, oh, yeah. And then instead of, you know... A, B, X, Y, we have uh, O, A, U, Y, you know, if you, you can spell the name of it <laughs> like that. Okay, get this guy out of here. Really cool that I had that drawer open. Oh, I got another controller here. I got got this thing here, another, yeah, the, the wireless, not uh, Bluetooth. Oh, and I got this thing I got at a yard sale for a dollar. As, as the joke in the video said, I was going to pay three dollars, but uh, my dad talked him down. Okay, so the actual console, yeah, it's uh, got some weight to it. Uh, my fear was that, you know, with these rounded off edges that would roll. So, which way is front? Okay, it says the name on it. Not sure, you know, we can get the glean white, right word for that. Get this thing. Those look like special screwdrivers, so, you know, the people who did the unboxings, or rather, I'd say groups that did the unboxings that could open it up, because individuals and unboxings, they can't hold a candle to, you know, places that have studios that they can do unboxings to. It's awesome right now, because I can't check comments that, uh, I'm just talking, talking. Okay, so, I'm gonna take this out the bottom. That appears to be a fan. So basically, you know, it's a it's a CPU in here. Well, okay, the CPU and everything. But it looks like that literally is the bottom of the CPU. The bottom of the CPU is the case itself. Uh, let's see. We got some uh, more. I can stay. Okay. So this looks like. What do we have here? Um, okay. That's internet, ether, uh, Cat5. You know, I didn't know the difference between a Cat5 cable and a phone cable for a long time up until college. This looks like micro USB in or out, I don't know, micro USB, which is different than mini USB. This is regular USB, this is HDMI, this is power, and uh, that's all the ports that we have, this little guy. So, uh, what do people, people show in reference to how small this thing is? I don't know, my, my hand's kind of small, I'm a smaller person, which is a surprise when people meet me in real life and just like, what, you're 5'5"? Five, five? Uh, let's, I don't know. God, we cinch. That's a recent thing. There we go. You know, smaller than the disc itself. Maybe that'll be entertaining. All right. God, we're cinching. I like that game. All right, so now what's under this? Because we can't just go like that. Okay, so that's that here. Um, let's see, can you see into this? Not too well, though. Not great of quality, also. <laughs> gonna take this out. Okay, so what do we have here? We have Duracell taped. Oh, I think, uh, I think my comments just, uh, updated here. Is it going up, Don? Lightweight of the PS3 controller makes it more mobile. Yeah, I guess I'm not making any arguments for or against OE right now. That might come later. I know everybody else's opinion. Uh, uh, lukewarm to meh. Yeah, I'm also going to need instructions on how to put this thing back. Are those actually updated? Oh, yeah, that's that, those are updating comments. Let's see. Top comment right now is 25142 Ryan Bryan. I gotta say it first like that, so in reference, he says, hey, thanks. Maybe he's saying it to somebody else. Um, okay, so, uh, sorry. This is, uh, another HDMI cable. Let's bust this thing open. If all things go correct, I can just hook this up and get going. I was actually pretty amazed in, in reference to the Wii U video that I did that uh, we actually got that thing running pretty smoothly. Um, as in we just hooked it up and, and went. It took minimal... Um, confusion time. Okay, so here we have HDMI. This will be the power. So, pass that over there. Power cable. And the power cable in reference to this. Yeah. Uh, and the OEA instructions. I'm guessing I'm saying it wrong because I just say everything wrong. 
Getting started in four simple steps. I'll go ahead and read this to you. Uh, connect the oh, to the TV. Use the HDMI cable included to make the connection. Power up. Power on the OEM by connecting the wall outlet using the included wall. Can I get it? Finally, turn on the TV. Look for OEM. Oh, that's the power button right there. Got it clicking. That's the power button. That's why in the oh, it's not in that picture. Uh, you know, that's why he's doing that. Okay, pair the controller. Hold. You know, I'm really confused by this thing. Like, how do we? Mess with that later. Figure a network. Please tell me it has wireless. Yeah. Okay, it's got wireless. Okay. Now, what's the rest of this stuff? Uh, looks like precautions in different languages, and that's that. Okay, so, um, I guess we should look at some more comments. Stu D said, what, what even is this thing? I don't know if many people know about the, the Oya. I guess we'll just lay it out right now. Oya is the first, uh, I mean, maybe there's ones before it, but first wide release Android based console. So what this is, this thing's a hundred dollars for everything you well that. Besides the table, everything you see here. Um and I guess uh, I don't know what else to like, explain it. I mean it's it's Android, so we'll see how this goes. Uh it's got a specific uh development community. Uh it had a Kickstarter event, which I did not know what a Kickstarter was before. Oh yeah, I had to ask on another live stream what it was, and then there was this idea for the Storm Dane Kickstarter. And I'd be like, cool, what would I do with that money? I'd probably get get better equipment and have a uh, lower output, probably. Um, the silver covers come off the controller. Okay. Um, how? Uh, who gave me that tip? That was Tanks M Morardi. Tonks Morardi, yeah. Um, up, down, pull. Oh, this is this is separating. Wow, that's promising. Okay. Wow. Is it how? I don't think it's it's really basically held in by friction. Sorry, I I pulled that off there. So, really? What this looks like is we put a. Uh, one of these double A's in and on each side. That's some. That's something. I don't know. This one goes in. This goes in positive this way. Let me just put. Let me get on there. There we go. Thanks, Tonks. Uh, Enigma says 9.5 million dollars. I guess that's referring to the Kickstarter amount. Sorry, I gotta take this close to my face so I can see. Oh, yep, same orientation. Okay, that would have been really interesting starting this thing up without power. I'm like, oh, look at these batteries here. So it looks like it's kind of like uh, the Wii, where it uh, operates off of uh, batteries that you provide. Yeah, it's really, it's just friction holding that in. You can just pop that thing open, no problem. Okay, now we've got that thing. Now let's follow the instructions that they gave us for this thing. I don't, I think we'll go and, I don't I think you guys have had enough of looking at my crotch, probably. Uh, let me take down this. Sorry, I was trying to think of the smoothest way to go about this. All right, I'm going to bring up the capture module, which is actually showing Wii U right now, but let's, uh, let's ignore that as I bring that up. All right. Okay. Now, the Oya, oh yeah, where should we place that? I'm going to flip this over so I can see what's going on. The Oya console itself. Let's go and put that on top of the Wii U. That's really that's where I put the Wii U during the live stream. It just sort of stayed there. Um, 
You know, we could use the provided HDMI, but if I could just take the HDMI out of the Wii U, then I can put it in here. By the way, I don't know if anybody really noticed, but I now have an HDMI capture device. It's it's the same, you know, it's it's Hot Pockets, Hot Pog, however you want to say it. Uh, okay. That same, it's the same company as what I was trying to get there. Plug this in. Let's get this thing right here. Oh, I actually got I actually got space down here. All sorts of plugs and okay, that, nothing has lit up yet. Good to know. So now I'm just gonna put HDMI cable down here. And for those who have been keeping count, damn, <laughs> there we go. The only thing left is the controller. So I'm gonna move this table. This table was bought by Ashley Cox, and now last name is Ashley, or last name's now Hagel, she's married now, um, in Portland, I highly doubt she's watching, and not much into video games, well, she likes Shadow of Colossus, you know, that, that's, that's, that'll give you the level of her credibility, but anyway, just want to say thanks for buying these things, they've been very useful, especially for the marriage. Top comment, <laughs> Enigma says, don't lose a console, tone balance, get out. Tone balance. Hey Storm, why is your wife ugly and eh, fat, dumb, faggot? Hmm. That, because there's no punctuation there, you could be calling me a uh, dumb faggot or call her a dumb faggot. That's the wrong thing to do is to give, I'd say, trolls credibility. Well, I don't know. I don't care. It's, it's live boredom. Um, alright. So now we got this thing pointed, I'm going to... You know, this is actually the wrong thing to do at this point. Where is the controller? Or rather, remote. I'm going to switch it like this. Um, menu input. We want to go to... Yeah, I guess I called it Blu-ray at some point. Now that you can actually read the screen here. Uh, Alright, this is a good place to stand. Looks good. Retrieving data. There's no data to really retrieve. Ah, it lit up here. Um... Well, it's got a white light going on there. It says no signal on the TV, though. Oh, that disappeared because we're getting 1080p. Awesome. And... Okay, well, that's what's going on. Okay, at this point, I'm actually going to switch the input for you to look at so this will look a little bit better. So give me one second here as I switch things. Um, okay, this is gonna look really bad. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, okay, keep the life warm logo. Take this one down, this screen region, and this right here. So oh there we go. I'm going to go and preview it myself to see what you guys can see. Uh, read some comments here. I think there's more. Uh, oh, God, I can't mark anybody as spam right now. Damn. Uh, slow PZZ. Digging around, digging around, digging around. Damn. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Referencing. Copying the HDMI signal, I mean. Uh, probably haven't, I haven't talked on these comments, so it's probably talking amongst each other here. Uh, let's go and check my uh, audio. Okay, if it's picking up this signal, then it's got to be picking up its audio. Uh, and I'll go and turn this audio up now. Now that we're actually on a different input. Oh, it, it was already up. Okay. So, what do we have here? Um, let me just... I'm not sure if you can... Well, you should be able to see it. It says, welcome at the top. To pair your controller, press the, this will be the cinch button they're referring to, the OU. I actually don't like that button until the two, the middle two LEDs are flashing. Oh, they got LEDs up here. Just like, you know, PlayStation 3, uh, we had it, um, Xbox, okay, let's stop talking. Okay, for, oh, those two, oh, they were flashing. They're flashing here. Ok, 
Okay, yeah, this sounds like something's going on under there. Okay, I let go. There we are. Uh, I guess, you know, to, in all fairness, it kind of is... <laughs> that's how Bluetooth sounds. They made a sound there. I hope it came across. Okay, so we only have one controller. I wonder. Hold on. I, I have this thing here for the sort of purpose of it. Let's, uh... That's not how you do it. And now it's trying to connect to what it was last connected to, which was a phone. If I do these two, then they start flashing. Let's just see. It's fun to happen. But anyway, um... Let's see. It'd be... They, so they have different, uh, um, you know, names, but they maintained colors. It's really hard to see on the camera here. Well, you can probably see it on the screen or on the video capture. But while we're doing comparison of controllers and delaying actual gameplay, let's see. Green, green, blue, blue, yellow, yellow, red, red. Oh, okay, so maintain that standard, and this thing's still flashing, so let's just take that out and say forget it. Alright, so we're going to continue with the green. Join a wireless network. Um, uh, well, yeah, I have a wireless network going. Um, wonder if I should even have this thing up while I put in my password. Well, I mean, how many people really live around me? So, well, if it even picks up the wireless network. Man, uh, comments, yes! The button spell, yeah, I know they spelled the name of it. It's, oh, yeah, says, uh, a Yoshi fan said the previous comment. Tonks, you apparently use the PS3 controller, can use the PS3 controller with Delia. Well, it's, it's Bluetooth, so, I mean, the, uh, no, PlayStation 3 has a network, how about that? Um, well, every, every controller is now Bluetooth, but anyway, uh, if you can pair it up just easily like that, eh, probably. I mean, I've hooked up a PlayStation 3 controller to a phone, uh, did a Wii controller. Alright, alright, let's just do this. How to, go to, how to get up to, you know, show password? Oh, okay. Okay, this is gonna be a mind blowing password, guys. All right, all right. You come over to my house. You you know that you know it. What's worse is this being is being recorded, and hmm. Oh, okay. Connect. There we go. Uh, I was using using some top buttons to move the field. There you go. Somebody make a Spaceballs reference. Successfully connected. Good, because every other thing in this house is connected to that thing. Checking for software updates. Oh, great. Bending genres. Oh, that's funny. Shooting stars. I forget there was some computer application that, uh, um, I think it said loading, loading, spanking monkey, and then said bad monkey. Arming proton and torpedoes. That's Refactoring, but what's funny? Oh, that, that's an actually a busier curve. Those things, you know, they're much rather than putting a bunch of polygons together to make a curve, you can actually say this is how a curve goes. And um, are those nerves? I don't know. We're talking computer speak now. Adding the fun. What's funny here is okay. They have to test this thing right here. They have to test whether uh, you know that they're uh, updating stuff. And what's funny is, oh, it's already repeating stuff. What's funny is, they might put this fun stuff in here, but um, if it ever freezes, then you will get sick of seeing arming proton torpedoes. All right, it was funny once. Let's get rid of it. Comments? Tonks, another re reviewer managed to do it. Yeah. Can you use the 360 controller? All oh, right, 360, I think, is referring to uh, what Ryan Bryan said. Um... I'm sure it's possible if you work hard enough. Um, but yeah, the thing about the uh, Xbox 360 controller is it's not, you know, standard Bluetooth. I think you might call it ISO standard. I don't know what standard is. 
but it's uh, it's its own blend of wireless. Little Weaver, loading takes a bit. Oh, Little Weaver, how's it going, man? I I I tend to point out, uh, you know, people I like or uh, people who are uh, big on YouTube. So I'm I'm calling out Little Weaver and Enigma Extreme. And shoot, I need to find out if you commented about Australia if I was totally wrong about it. Uh, this computer is in no state to do his searching though. Let's let's go to the middle of some comments and see. Oh, there's some spam. Okay. How about the OU specs? Are they better than the average Android uh, phone or similar? They are much higher. It's actually got a 1.7 gigahertz uh, CPU. Uh, RAM, I don't know. Um, might be irrelevant. Well, no, ra okay, RAM is all irrelevant. Never mind about that. And I think it's got 8 gigs of storage, which we'll be testing. Uh, I want, intend to do some side loading, not to give too much away. Um, let's see. Sun Michael, haha, ha, jokes on loading screen. Sun Michael, yes, I'm going to call you out too. I, I, I think you're pretty cool. Okay, everybody's cool here. Uh, Sun Michael, actually, when I was looking on, like, live events when I was looking for myself and you know www.youtube.com as it is in the US slash uh, live I actually found your channel for some li uh, streaming events hmm I wonder if I'm choppy or the stream is choppy alright let's go ahead and wander back to the controller your update is finished loading click OK to apply and restart your console alright well, well that's gonna look on the uh Fuck off, prepping for installation. Please do not turn off the oh, oh yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> or unplug the power while the update is applying. So it's installing. That's what. Whoa! You know what that looks like? That looks like a phone. That looks like uh, ice cream sandwich. Actually, um, it's a uh, modified um, jelly bean, which is uh, Android 4.1, which I wish I knew about. <laughs> you know, I say this stuff, but you know, I'm not too knowledgeable. Okay, I'm, I'm, so I'm going to call it Oya, oh yeah, and then you guys can correct me if that's what I was saying before and it's still wrong. Little viewer, it's fun to be famous, isn't it? Uh, Enigma says, I did, man. I live in uh, Tasmania. Oh, oh, in Australia. Oh, shoot, where'd it go? Um, I really want to read what Enigma was saying there. Uh, I haven't slept... Uh, a few days because of uh, la The Last of Us. Oh, yeah. Once I, I included uh, one of the main characters in a picture in the last review, um, The Last of Us, I, don't know, I think people were asking me to play it. Uh, Venom Supreme says, I'm going to be in the Reno Tahoe International Airport in a couple weeks. Is that Batman slot machine still there? Probably. Um, it can lo it loads up. Um, it's a... It, it's a cabinet with five slot games on it, and the top is a 107-inch um, screen, and it's got two screens on the side for it. Anyway, they can load up Ghostbusters or something on it, uh, just the same. So, all right, here we go. What is it? We're period controller, uh, okay. No, well, if we did, I guess I only had to push it one time. Oh, no, push until the middle two. Oh, great, no, did it pair of... This is the stuff we test for. Well, the company making tests for it. Choose a network. That's fine. But the airport is definitely out of range for uh, my uh, uh, my wireless network. Um, it's only about a mile away, actually. I yeah. Continue. What? <laughs> Console is up to date. Continuing new account, existing account. Um. Well, I guess I don't have an OE account, so I guess new account. <sighs> Alright guys, uh, uh, I, yeah. I'm gonna have to really take this one down, because I don't need uh, hackers. Not that, to say that you guys would do anything malicious, but let's just be safe here. Alright, now you can look at me. Oh no, I, okay, if I just cover up that side of it. There we go. I cover up the keyboard. Light boredom! 
Good stuff. Okay, so <laughs> username. Uh, well, well, it was on the G, but uh, I, yeah, I actually was planning on doing G. So let's let's make it consistent with everything else. You spell Golden Eye Man, except a little bit different. It's Golden Eye Man. So add me as a friend if that functionality is there. Um, I wonder if everybody else had to do this on their live streams of it. <laughs> but anybody else did it. Goid and I. There's a story behind that, and I guess I could tell the story. The, the initial story is this was my. Golden Eye Man was my username on GameFAQs. So, um. Uh, that, that, that naturally was what I. I, I forget how I even came up with that, but that's the one I did the reviews under. So. Um, you know, the reviews are still up, that's gotta be well over a decade old. Um, so, when I was trying to get a username for, um, Xbox, I was spelling out a golden eye man, but, I don't know, it's really hard to talk and think about the stuff I'm pushing right now, but it was on a, a standard definition screen, and I did, I can differentiate the L or the I, I if I thought about it logically, it'd be there, but I just went to what it looked like, an L, it was an I, and now I'm going to an I man. It's in my email here. Uh, oh, wait, wait, back up, back up. I gotta get this on the app symbol, which is down the corner. wireless keyboard to this, but the wireless keyboard is now hooked up to my, it's hooked up to my computer right now, and uh, it's in a corner that usually, you know, finds static, and you touch it, and the computer goes down, and you guys have a even more boring live board, I'm alright, password, uh, this, this is the touchy part, see if you can count how many characters it has. Special characters and uh, at least one letter and one number. Okay, just making super sure. I, whatever, this stuff goes out in the recording, and you guys can hack all my accounts. Just in case you weren't able to count before, I gotta enter it again because uh, it's confirm password. Register and I might be able to pull this back. Up. Ah, shoot! Oh, um, I lost it. Oh, sorry, you clicked on the wrong window there. I got a computer. I need to bring this guy back up so I can bring this over and. I think that's what we want. No, no, it's not what we want. Okay, so let's just hope that actually registers. Um, delay on that. I don't want to look at input that's delayed. So. Let's go ahead and say register. Yeah, well, there's my, there's my email address, guys. I've showed in other uh, videos. Uh, uh, confirm. Is they want? Looks like indication is at twenty. What? I I have a, a live stream going. I think that it's. What? What? Is, I don't know what. 
try something. Um, because we we might have to do that all. We might be doing that all day. another Ethernet cable. So I could just directly hook it up. I mean, I don't think I have anything else hooked up that I could jack it from. Uh, that's going to the computer. Well, come on, please, just register. Check over in here. Yeah, this is stuff you don't plan for. This is what makes it life boredom. Uh, I know I have a purple cable. It came with the, uh, with the, um, the modem. Uh, and then I bought a very long one, so modem's in there, cable modem's in there, and uh, wireless things up here. Oh, boy. Let's keep on trying. Anyone's got some suggestions? <laughs> Face palm outplus. Oh. What do you want from me? I learned so much about Storm already today, yeah. <laughs> I have this as well. Uh, I seem to be saying names. The the Glomper 16. Uh, something cool kid says that. Well, shucks. Where is that cable? So you definitely talk amongst yourselves now. If I was intelligent, I could give you a subject like a. Uh, uh, what would coffee talk? Being all the clumped. Update, no success. Because if this doesn't work, I'm going to have to take it offline. Take take the live stream offline. How many viewers do I got? 
45 from current, that's pretty damn good. Well, maybe it's not my problem, maybe it's, oh yeah. Damn, it might just behoove me to just turn this thing off. I mean, I am getting. Yeah, I got I got full bars on my uh, my laptop here. So it's not my fault that it's boring. Now it's the console. Okay, let's just take that thing off. I'm gonna shut down. How quick we we learn to use these. Okay. Uh. Well, damn, do it! Alright, so that's off my TV screen. I don't think it's picking up anything. So, let's go and turn on again. Right now it says no signal, but I think that's just a bit of delay. That might have some sort of sound associated with it, but uh, I can't hear it right now. Okay, so, let me two. I just push it once. Okay, it's connected. Good. So an apartment, which is everything else. Everything else. Oh, Jesus. Da, 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 da. Oh, you know what? I don't think it's even showing up in the... Yeah. Uh, it's not even showing up on... Uh, thing right now, so... I'll fix that in a moment. So, let's go ahead and... Try this again! Yeah, let's go for broke. Maybe the computer's gonna crash right now. Uh, it's pulling! Okay, and... appears to still be in operation. I'm gonna attempt to put this thing... In the USB guy on the back. This right now, this right here is, is my um, it's my uh, keyboard that I'm hooking up. So there we go. That can be a lot faster. Whoops. Hotmail.com. Oh wait, that's supposed to be my username. Let me capitalize this now. Boy, man, sure, yes. Confirm. Okay, that appears to be working now. Okay, funding the fun. Oh, indeed. I gotta enter a credit card right now. Okay, so I'm gonna keep it offline still. Oh, I think I just showed it completely. Hmm. No, I'm covering that up, so. Okay, alright, good. So, if I'm on this side of the camera, you can see me. Yes. Uh, okay, so let's say, making any purchases requires credit card or debit card. Alright, so probably not giving this stuff out. Let's get a true preview of uh, of what it looks like. I don't know, maybe maybe the the system timed out and uh or maybe the, the wireless connection timed out. I don't know. I don't know what that was. Maybe we sweat over here. Well, I'm sweating because it's freaking hot in this room. Um let's just cover up the in Oh shoot. Okay, well if I keep my head right about here because that thing I got, um, you can't see it, but uh, the thing that I uh, hooked up my keyboard to also does the mouse. So, keep my head really still here. I can cover up my information. <laughs> uh, name my card. Well, maybe not my name. Okay, this is the important part. This is the card number. If I can just remember it, um, wow, 
not hiding it, damn. Uh, I don't dare look down at the keypad for fear of my head moving. Okay, I'm gonna make this work. Shoot, just move my head. <laughs> oh, that's not it. Still gotta keep it here. Predicament I get myself into. Uh, tab? Yeah, it works. Oh, um. Okay. Uh, and. The year. The security code. Uh, I'll give you this. this Uh, give me the guys this one for free. My postal code eight nine five zero two. So, gave me a problem with server uh, air first. Can I move my head now. All right. God, I have to change my card now because I know somehow that information got out. Okay. Uh, nice job. You're on your way. Remember, you can always check. How about... Okay, so right now we're on something good here. Uh, I'm going to take out the uh, keyboard thing. Whoa, jeez, what is that? I guess that was switching controller. So, I'll uh, hook this thing back up. Way I'm hooking that thing back up to the computer now. Okay, computer appears to still be in operation. Uh, let me uh, attempt to fix the output problem. Citing an original content like this is what YouTube is made for. Yep. Pretty sure your details weren't visible. Cool. Haven't seen Onya before, and I'm excited to see what it turns out. Um, Vermin Supreme, whether that was uh, sarcastic or serious, I love that comment. Exciting and original content like this is what <laughs> YouTube was made for. Uh, okay, I gotta switch back to the TV. Where is that? Like, this is like the Blu ray remote, but I haven't. I need to put that away so I stop confusing it. Uh, I need to switch back to the computer. Uh, let's see, if I just refresh that, if that doesn't work, I gotta unplug and replug in the hot, whoa, 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 okay, that's not good, getting better, there we are, okay, back in business, let's keep going, uh, I should probably be sitting by it right now. Um, let me change the perspective here. Uh, I gotta move this. Oh wait, this is on a chair, and I need to sit on a chair. Oh, I need to go get another chair, guys. Stay right back. I'm not stretching that pretty far. You know, if I was in a studio, this stuff would already be set up. The uh, wireless network would work perfectly. We'd have no problems. Well, that isn't going to work. Uh, I gotta... Oh, God. Everything I put in place is on top of all the wires. So I'm moving the table, the unboxing table. And... Tilt this back. Hopefully the computer won't fall off. Uh, well, it came close. So, move this here. And rattle, rattle, rattle. Here we are. As I move across more incriminating evidence of what this room looks like. Let's move to the side. Yes, that is my uh, curtain. <laughs> 
Where's the controller? Here we are. Let's get it zoomed in on me only. And how disgusting I look right now with all the sweat. And let's take a look at my preview. Hopefully this was flawless. Okay, I can move stuff now. God, I'm gonna need that water. Uh, move this closely. I really don't know what's gonna happen now, guys. We got it set up. We've looked at it. Now it's just like white light hurts. Yeah, there's a lot of. Let's fix that, guys. So I was messing with it earlier. Oops. It's already on the fitting. Let's make it manual. Now I'm dark and gritty. Yeah. That's actually, that actually looks pretty good. I mean, on the camera itself, I don't know how the preview looks. <laughs> you get to see the settings and everything. That is just awesome. That's what we want on YouTube. I think I might print that one out. Vermin Supreme. All right. And just in reference to me holding my head over my credit card information. Uh, okay. Bionic Pizza Man. Storm, give the tour, video tour of your house. Yeah, I'd have to do that. Yeah, <laughs> I'd have to record it and then play it back. Uh, it's not very interesting. It's a um, three-bedroom, two-bath in uh, the poor section of North Reno. <laughs> Little Weaver says you're back. Well, I don't think you missed much, man. <laughs> um, uh, I don't be 12 says lol. Um, Rockstar says yeah, works great. I'm up around here. Uh, kind of dark, like Batman. Uh, Nigma Extreme looks fun. Okay, let's do something. I think play means we're gonna look at games that we already have here. Uh, time to fill her up. Room in here, right? That's because you haven't picked up any games yet. Uh, okay, so I was right there, so. Oh, it took me automatically to discover. What were the other options? Uh, make? Mm -hmm. What's this all about? Hold on tight just a second. This area is for those brave souls who dare to dream develop their own games. Well, you put it on the front screen, guys. From here, you can also add unofficial games and apps, commonly referred to as sideloading. I first heard sideloading in an article referring to, oh yeah, just, it's just putting something on an Android phone. And so, yes, I do have an Android phone now, so uh, I, I'm a little more well-versed in Android stuff. I did have that... that Nook tablet, um, uh, that was rooted to make it, uh, it was a piece of crap, because it was a Nook color, and it, the processor wasn't that great. Uh, kit section to build games, on oh yeah, well, it really is, to build, hmm, software, uh, okay, manage, accounts, controllers, networks, system, Let's go to advance. We've got an advance. Yeah, this looks a lot like uh, uh, Android. Okay, well, back. So I want to look look at this. Um, so so that's software. Let me look at the browser here. Hmm. Yeah, well, I want to change the address, guys. Um, well, that did something. Uh, let's go to... This is going to be so freaking rad. So anyway, it's got a browser. And it's a browser because it's Android. And it's the Android browser is the closest I've found to anything Chrome. Uh, well, sorry, it's the closest I've found to uh, a non-computer browser. That is pretty... Uh, how do I shift? Dang it! Well, whatever. It's not what I was trying to do. Oh god, where am I? There we go. We go to YouTube. And if it's Android, it can support Flash. So let's see what's on YouTube right now. Oh, you're not... Ugh. It's mobile. Alright. Back up. Back. I don't... 
Stop caring. Uh, exit browser. Because on the phone we can make it look for, uh, uh, we can make it like desktop stuff. Okay, well, uh, let's go ahead and discover here. I have to get one game at least. Alright, Shadow Gun, that's one I've heard about a lot before Oyo was even around. You don't know Jack, awesome. Bard's Tale, I think that was an Xbox game. Rush Bros, Dub Wars. I think on the Oyo website it said how many games. Maybe it was just right there, I didn't see it, but there's like over 200 games on Oyo right now. Uh, so those are featured. As in, you pay to get them on there, probably. If you're on only on Oya, okay, Oya exclusives. Okay. Kill screen playlist. I don't know what that means. The Penny Arcade report. Ben. Oh, great. People with influence, not me. Uh, they get to have their say in what they like. Our, our founders, the true believers. Okay, showcase. Couch gaming with friends. Alright, trending now. Trending now, great. Oh, is that the true Final Fantasy 3? Oh, it is. Yeah, the one that I call Final Fantasy 6. Is <laughs> what you guys call Final Fantasy 6, I call Final Fantasy 3. Genres, that would be a great place to look. Sandbox. Okay, so we're at the bottom here. So, arcade pinball, we've got retro, platforming, with friends, short on time, yeah, first person shooter, apps. Oh, oh. <laughs> what do we got on apps here? Amy. Okay, don't know what that is. Twitch TV competitor. That's a question that I got for you guys. Should I do Twitch TV? Because, I mean, really, really contractually obligated, but um, what works best for you guys? Motherboard, clock, flickster, tune in, you know. Oh, okay. That's something. I gotta move, I gotta look around the camera to look at this stuff. Uh, dual sticks, all ages. Trivia, some strategy, adventure, role playing, it just keeps going. Uh, meditative? Uh, okay, let's go over to, um, because I'm, I'm, I'm curious, whoa, well, how, how many are there? Oh, well, when you include shooter in it, then, yeah. Oh, great, how many zombie games are we going to get on this console? Ah. What's popular right now? Zombies, let's do it. Uh, Shadowrun, of course. Shadowrun is the one that everybody knows. Um, and, man, da, 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 da. Okay, we'll download, but that's also got to be. Well, what do I got? Pay? Or does it just. Uh, side load paying? I mean, uh, just, uh, um, okay, well. Okay, it's downloading. Okay, so while that's doing that thing, I got something else. Uh, I gotta remember where it is now. Much like Ethernet cables that I plan to never use. In my pocket here? No. Uh, I'll, if I do get to playing Shadowgun, I think it's called Shadowrun. Not, that's not what it's called, Shadowgun. If I do get to playing Shadowgun, I gotta, I gotta change the title. Much like how I was playing Nintendo Land on that first, um... No, it was New Super Mario Brothers playing with uh, Patrick on the Wii U. Dang, where? Oh, it's still on the computer. Okay. This might freak out. It just uh, make sure that things are... Okay, it's still running smoothly. Still got a stream going. Okay. And... Yank. Alright. We all still here? We're all still alive? Yeah, I do this stuff because USB and my computer and the static electricity, it's done. Not, it doesn't do that great. Okay, right here I have a, a stick. I'm going to put it into the Oya, and we're going to see what happens there. Because I'm guessing, um, well, I'm guessing we can download in the background, I hope. Okay, yeah, it looks like it's on in the background. Um, let's back up further and further. And let's see here. Plug this in. Okay. So we can plug in devices into the 
I'm plugging, plugging USB to the OEA, much like I do with the keyboard. So there you go. That's something you learn on live boredom. You next hook up keyboards and all right. So manage system console information advanced storage. Hmm. I'm not sure if it's you can see the. Uh, Huh. Yeah, I don't think you can see the thing I just plugged in. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 what's this? Oh, that's, that's the only one. No. Hmm. Okay. Um, I'm just going to be digging around on this now. Shoot, I'm gonna have to learn how to load other things on here because uh, I had plans for this <laughs> uh, for after we discovered the OEA about actually putting apps on here. <laughs> hmm, let me think about this now. We might have an intermission, guys. I don't know if you are watching right now. Um, probably looking at the wrong spot. 54, I don't know. I don't know if I want to drop that many people. That's. A lot. All right, let's go back to discover. See how the shadow gun's doing. God. What if I? Uh, let me mischief here. Okay, we're gonna let that thing continue. Then moving. And who knows if I make the computer crash right now? Um, <laughs> maybe, just maybe. Um, it'd be a nice intermission. I unhook this. Okay. It's a mystery of what I'm doing right now, but uh, I promise it should be interesting if it works. I can't see because it's turning to light right now. Um, turn this upside down. Alright, what I just did was I... I have practically all the ports in the back linked up right now. I had just hooked up the Oya to my computer. So, um, we're all still alive? Oh, concurrent view is dropping. Great, yeah. It's good. It's just like, what's this, Gary? Oh, you know what? You can't even see it, says it's downloading, because I'm over that part of the screen. I'm sorry, guys. And back up, and then now you can see it probably at the top of the, uh, the feed there. Still doing its thing. All right, so um, well there you go. You guys can see it because it's on the screen right now. Uh, it says Oya console hooked up. Well shoot, maybe I shouldn't have even you know hooked this thing. Okay, I'm plugging this this stick right here, and I'm putting it back into the computer because the computer can see the Oya. I mean, I wish I could consider myself a, a hacker. I'm just not that. Let's be truthful here. I'm just not that smart. Um, how is going on the screen here? Okay, I'm back. Okay, now I'm gonna get back up. Uh, change the input on my screen. This uh, this is me running around messing with my computer while waiting for Shadow Gun to download. Which, I don't know, for 300 uh, megabytes, go pretty fast. Um, I'm going to move this out of the way. Oh, okay, so we've got two things. Oop, i got to move over here, and then move it all the way up over here. Unless, well, let's just, let's just take a look at what's on the OEA. Oh, yeah. Um, here we go. So it says, I mean, it's losing space as we speak because Shadow Gun's downloading. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this is very much set up a lot like, well, I keep on saying that, but it's, uh, um, yeah, it looks like an Android phone. So, 
So, if I open this right here... Oh, let me see what my devious plans are. Four items that I'd like to sideload onto here. Um, ammo, haste. Okay. All without turning off the. Oh, yeah. Let's see if. How do I make them appear? That's, that's the big mystery to me. Um, oh, I got that stuff covering up my FaceTime here. I'm even showing up still. No, that thing's froze. Oh, great. Um... Well, okay, this is all very tech stuff. Hmm. Take a look at everything on the Oh, you here? Okay, so down. Let's see. The downloads be eighteen. No downloads. Um, it'd be really nice if I could look at everything on here. Okay, well that's everything, but stuff that I just put on. Data usage. Oh, was... <laughs> All right. It's calendar. Five or two. Then I'm at... Well, where does the browser live? Okay, I'm gonna take you guys back to Discover, and so you guys can continue to watch Shadow Gun do its thing while I do more. Tinkering around. It's probably showing up on that screen right there. Yeah. Let's see. So downloading. These are pictures of face podcast ringtones. What if I drop that there? I might actually break down and say, like, how do I side load on the oh yeah, I guess it's uh If I had a browser, Hold on. Da, 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 da. Apps. Let me check this. 
Oh, what's this? Well, it allows you to add and install applications. Oh, yeah, boot sequence so that it's automatic start of the device. Um. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Let's do that. Now, so we got boot. Um. How big is that? Oh, 700k, so that should... Oh, you gotta wait for Shadow Gun to finish. What's this? Allow out to tell a smartphone keep on. Oh, yeah. Hmm, you can... Okay, so that I could use a phone as the keyboard on this guy. Which TV, you know that? That's radio, that's for movies, it's clock. Play your PC games. What's this here? Remote desktop oriented gaming performance. Stream your PC games from your PC to your own. Ah, kind of cool. Plex, you can stream music. Ah, okay, it's another streaming service. Still waiting for Shadow Gun to finish. We can drop it down in the queue. Nope. Okay, well, um, you guys, I don't think it's still frozen. You've been looking at my curtain for a long time here. <clears throat>
Ready? Yes, John. The transmission is secure. <laughs> How do I look? The same as always. Oh, that bad, huh? Good morning, Mr. Slade. Did you receive your initial payment? Yeah, I did. Very good. I have been instructed to remind you of the delicate nature of our problem. Toltec Enterprises believes Dr. Simon to be very dangerous and very capable. Before fleeing our facility, he kidnapped his entire staff and stole all of the lab equipment. Ambitious guy. I'm surprised you didn't involve the Fed. Dr. Simon was head of our genetic research division. He had access to highly classified genetic materials, and our employee extraction protocols must be conducted in private. I'm sure you understand. Extraction protocols. <laughs> oh, I love it when you corporate types get all technical. No, your orders are dead or alive. But we strongly prefer you return Dr. Simon to us unharmed. We have reliable information that he secured himself in the Prime System on a small planet named Eve. Yeah, no worries. I'll bag the doc and get him back to you. In one piece. Or two, depending on his mood. Good luck, Mr. Slade. I trust you will not disappoint us. I've been disappointing people my entire life. Why well, stop now? Sarah, set coordinates for Eve, Prime System. How's it look, Sarah? Surface reports indicate optimal landing conditions near an abandoned mining facility. I am unable, however, to receive tech or life form data. Uh, my stomach's grumbling. Hopefully, I'll get back in time to grab some chow and Centauri. You were assuming this mission will be easy. I never assume. But yeah, this mission will be easy. Launch sequence ready. And go. up on your scanners yet? I still cannot initiate scanning sequence. We are being jammed. Which means the good doctor is expecting us. Yes, and the nuclear missiles were also an excellent indicator. Sarah, was was that sarcasm? No, I will attempt to locate alternate frequencies. Sarah, out.
What the hell are these things? Sarah, I'm uploading a tissue sample through Comlink. Roger that. Yeah, I just realized that uh, without <laughs> without the uh, uh, without one of those uh, programs running, you couldn't hear what I was saying. <laughs> Whoops! Uh, can you hear me now, guys? Please. Um, let me just uh, fiddle around with uh, some of the devices here. Okay, so what I need to do is take this. Move over, move the screen, make it big, and then close it. Okay, how's that? Uh, uh yeah. <laughs> Whoops. So, uh, I just, I didn't realize when I closed that, that I'd actually be exiting out the audio, because I usually have a separate audio device. I'm using the on mic camera. I wanted to denote that I was trying to give shout-outs to, um, uh, Deano Jackson, uh, and he was, uh, commenting about, uh, what's the appeal of the, uh, oh yeah, and I was having a monologue with myself about like, yeah, it's, you know, it's here, do we need it? It's $100. And uh, I'm mainly playing it because I'm curious about it. I was wondering if like, oh, don't seem to be, <laughs> don't seem to be getting much comments about what I'm saying. So um, let me get back in there. Now, one of the comments was that uh, I could just get the, uh, the emulator on the store. And I'm just like, well, duh, why didn't I think of that? Because that's actually what I read online, which gave me the idea of like let's run some uh, some games. <laughs> of course, I, I always have grander ideas than what actually happens for these live streams. <laughs> it's great. I can see in here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So what I've learned <laughs> is that um, yes, uh, we can download it. I guess everything. I guess everything has to have a trial, kind of like on live. Um, so you can download it, and then if you choose to, you can buy it. So, let's do the search, and let's... Jeez, I forgot what it was even called. Um, I need to get my phone so I can look at the name of that emulator. Phone over here! Jeez, I, I don't know how much time... I, I know that we lost audio when I took the thing down, because it was frozen. Uh, which is questionable if it even had audio back then. So, let me just... Get some ideas here. Okay. Um, uh, and there we go. God, I'm 
such... <sighs> this sucks. Uh, what? Uh, looked like there was some kind of error on screen. Let's try that again. Okay, that's in Q and the Q. Uh, what was the other one? I don't know. We'll just we'll just say uh, S N E S. There we go. So I'm using the trigger to do this. You can actually, and you can hook up a keyboard and mouse for this. Uh, let's download that. That's in the queue. And let's download. That. Okay, so let's play. Boot, I forgot what I was doing with that. Anyway, so, um, so, let's load a game. Um, jeez, I think I put it in the root directory. I think I even saw it. Yeah, Super Mario World. Okay, um, maybe I need to show you that I have the license to play this. That's really loud. Hope you guys can still hear me. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I, I have this game myself. Wonder, there's. Wait, so is. We gotta wait for this thing, but yeah, with no start and select, I guess. We got, I mean, Eleanor, that was something that the uh, uh, some of the uh, Super Nintendo had. I'm guessing start and select would be these triggers. Uh. Okay. So let's just give this a shot. I didn't have to configure anything yet. Whoa, uh, yeah, with that plastic still on the, uh, controller. <laughs> uh, this thing right here, I'm really slipping, I'm sliding on it. Oh my god, how do you... Okay, one of, clicking one of the triggers actually, uh, did the pausing for me. I need to get the thing off here. So we gave a true opinion of our emulation. <laughs> Game's louder than you. Damn it! Damn it! I knew it was gonna be that way. Uh, let's... Let's back out. Come on, have something about volume! Cause I can't really control the... <laughs> um... Well! We're gonna play, and I can't narrate, so... Whoops! Another thing. Uh, let me turn this down. That might contribute. Back in the game! Oh, now I can't hear the game at all, but...
so there you go. That here's my commentary. Uh, the poor performance due mainly to um, the lag of the Bluetooth controller. Um, it it's fine. You can actually do it, but I'm gonna actually just exit this and move on. Uh, now I'm gonna try something that I will find very pleasing, but we've. We've already talked about um, it doesn't really work too well, the uh, N64 emulation. It's not that bad. I forgot what we're saying. Uh, how does DS emulation run? Yeah, I... <laughs> well, I only got two ROMs uh, preloaded on this. <laughs> Golden, I... I've I just really, I haven't told you what the what N64 game I have here. Uh, okay, that's great. Um, so find the game. It should be there. We go. Play. Uh. Okay, I have it. Yeah, it's, it says resume. If I had played something, maybe you guys can hear me. Okay, that's looking awesome. Nintendo logo not showing up. That's. game. Uh, yeah, back up. Uh, there's, we got some settings to do. Uh, put controller function, okay, on. Map volume keys, well, volume keys would be on the actual. Hmm, okay, so, uh, I want C-pad Whoops. Oh, that was supposed to be right. 
Oh, can you clear that? Ah, God. <laughs> Just making it worse. I need a controller. Oh, well, how about that? I'm utilizing the touch screen that's right here. Eh, that's how we do it. Okay. So, come on. Let's try this again. Gotta unmap. This could be bothersome. Oh, I did it wrong. I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, I, I barely remember them talking about an actual uh, <clears throat> a touchpad, touchpad on the screen, or touch thing. Fuck, frick! What did I just push? C-pad up is actually good. I want the C-pad down. Okay, so now we want... There we go. Now we'll make these guys on the right stick. Whoops. Pushing the wrong thing again. Okay, so we want analog to be this stick. And then we want um, this stick. Okay, so let's see if that helps any. Zoom!
Once again, I'm sorry, guys. The uh, audio source is the same uh, for the game as it is me because the goddamn dog broke my headphones yesterday. So that's why we're having a substandard, even for live boredom standards, live stream. All right, so that's super exciting uh, that I can actually uh, get a full uh, frame rate here. Uh, well, it doesn't look like a full frame rate there. But anyway, it, it, pretty good frame rate there, and I'm guessing the audio is great. Uh, I mapped the controls, so uh, I was playing it on a phone before with uh, an on-live controller, and uh, the, the mapping basically meant, like, uh, if you push your stick in any distance, you go full speed. This thing is actually a little more fine-tuned, I guess, so, uh... How terrible it is that we're using this for ROMs. Uh, I think that's probably it. Oh, the Gaming Bridge Show showed up. Uh, what program are you using to stream that doesn't let you turn the audio game down on it? Well, it's, it's, basically, it's because it's the same source that's uh, using the... Okay, okay, my camera, I'm hooking, I'm hooking up through Pinnacle, and Pinnacle's picking up my audio and playing my audio um, through the PC speakers. Uh, no, well, not PC speakers, that's... Wrong. But through um, whatever, whatever the computer is listening to to output audio. Same thing uh, when I uh, when I have the the oh yeah going through HDMI, I, it's playing it through whatever the the computer would hear. I'm pointing at my ear right now. I'm not sure you can see that. So then it just blasts them both both at the same time. And for that I apologize. I can't really can't really do much there. Uh, I heard Pierce Brosnan uh, start in that live-action movie adaptation of the video game. Yeah, I saw that once. Nah. So, um, I guess this was another live stream where I was going to ask for uh, input on how to improve live streams. Well, one would be get another uh, headphone set where I can actually talk to you guys over the games. Um, another question I have, and this will be terrible because people are probably speaking, not hearing my questions yet, is, um, what, do, what does everybody prefer? And I'll, I'll read these comments after the live stream's done. Is there, does anybody really think I should move over to Twitch TV? Because I have an account that, which was grandfathered from Justin TV. Um, it's just that, you know, Machinima would really like me to, uh, well, through contractual obligation, keep on saying that. That's a not buzzword. Um, that I do the live streams on YouTube because that's where they can place their ads. And of course, if I were to do stuff on, uh, on uh, HD, oh, God, I got my stuff. If I was to do stuff on Twitch TV, I then after done, I'd upload it to YouTube. Of course. Oh man, recording via HDMI. Do you have Hotbox too, or are you work with an adapter? Yeah. Um. Early in the show, I explained that I do have the Hot Pod 2. I would have liked to make a video about that, but then, you know, the videos are delayed by in for the other reasons. Um, another question, frequency. Would everybody like this to be a weekly show? Because I think I could probably work with Sarah. Uh, and when I wasn't married, I could just do it. But uh, I could probably, I was work with Sarah on some sort of deal. Like, okay, so let's make this a weekly thing. And then maybe you could actually see the stardom that I'm hoping for. That's really mean of me to say. Um, while I'm waiting for everybody else to make their comments, let's go ahead and take a look at what everybody was saying when they couldn't hear me. Goldeneye in high definition. Oh, God. Now it's... Oh, Jesus, my eardrums are bleeding. It's that loud? I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Veramente Bravo. Balance the audio. Yay. Yes, move to Twitch. No to Twitch TV, stay on YouTube. Uh, Enigma says move. Beat says no. Owl Plus says Twitch is better. You don't, uh, I don't really do Twitch TV so much like that uh, I do on YouTube stuff. Uh, Owl Plus says yes. Or maybe I already read him. Oh, yeah, yeah. So Twitch is better. Um, <clears throat> well, there's an option in uh, XSplit where I could just go to both, I had to monitor two, uh, two comment streams, but heck, why not? There we go. Let's, uh, you guys can pick whichever one you want, and I'll stream to both. Hmm.
I like that idea. Change the timing so I could be awake to watch one. <laughs> yeah, I also wanted to get in here earlier so it wasn't so damn hot in this room, but the, game, the computer was running all night, so it's hot anyway. Um... All oh, right, Enigma, you're, uh, yeah. Well, I, I put it at this time because it'd be 5, uh, at 9 o'clock, my predict it's like 5 p.m. in England, so there we go. Uh, C. Nelson says, yes, weekly would be great. Weekly sounds good. Use YouTube. Usually on my Wii for watching videos uh, on the browser. <laughs> Only sports HTML5, not Flash. How about that? Uh, so how does... Okay, well, we're all going to have to figure out our own time zone here. Uh, if I were to do the stuff at 12 noon versus 9 a.m. So go ahead and... Pacific Standard Time is what Nevada's in. You can go and pick whichever... Whichever... Uh, uh, well, just throw out times. Times that would work for you. Go over to more audio bleeding ears. Drums audio is dead for me. Oh yeah, this is back when I was uh, playing the other game. Play MC Pixel, use a PS3 controller, fun times with the Lancer, Tower Fall, you can download APKs through the browser. Oh, frigging duh, of course, that's how I would get them. Um, Enigma gave me that tip there a long time ago. Alright, what are people saying? I'm still stuck on the Twitch thing. This is the best uh, progress ever achieved on a <laughs> Stormbean live stream. Yes! With ear bleeding audio. YouTube better, just no ads. Um, I'm not really in control of the ads, that's machinima. Mm -hmm. Who said that? Oh, I gotta say, uh, the spawning pool said that. Mm -hmm. uh, Twitch chat functions uh, ten times better than YouTube comments. Yeah, I bet. Oh, man. Uh, what were people saying at the beginning of the uh, podcast? Let's see. This is back when I was, you know, taking attendance. Uh, Mega Man, uh, before I even started the emulation, Mega Man uh, 1880 says, a hundred dollar emulator machine. Yep. Pretty much what it does. Uh, that's when I got the, uh, when I, oh, that's, that was a hate comments. Yeah, that was a long time ago. I remember that. Um, Gaming Brit says, I stream occasionally on Twitch. It's pretty, a pretty reliable place to stream. Chat system, uh, can get a bit uppity. Oh, that'd be awesome. 12 Pacific is like 5 a.m. here. Well, dang. Um, so, <laughs> it'd be super early for you. Uh, let's see. How many viewers we got? That'd be another thing to look at. 29 viewers. 29 people giving, deciding the fate, the future of live boredom. And while you guys are working out the timing here, um, do you think I need an intro for this? Because I was, I was starting to write a song. You can really say what I make is a song. I was trying to write, um, and who knows where I'd get a jingle from. I'd probably contact one of the many people that I get music from, not illegally here, but um, I'd say like, okay, make it a, uh, well, actually, I knew, I knew where I could steal one, I, I could just loop the intro part, um, but anyway, intro or not, do you think it's unnecessary, I mean, the reason why I changed the intro in the actual adventures is to make it shorter, At 21 seconds was the original riff, and it's just like, who needs that much time there, you know, I just... Make it shorter and different jingle. Uh, right now it's 5 a.m. in Australia. Dang. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. Like, no matter what time you were to do something, it's always middle of the night somewhere on this planet. So, um... Oh, that'd be, that'd be great. The dude, like, twice. Yeah, <laughs> twice in one day. Like, the uh, evening and night services at a church or some uh, evening is night so uh, morning and night services uh, that a church might provide <laughs> current schedule is uh, fine for me I'm in Texas yeah for the United States I'd say it's a pretty good it, it works all around 
uh, Eli asked, you can do both Twitch and YouTube uh, to... <laughs> Please explain, everybody. It's um, program XSplit. Uh, you can... You actually have... You don't say... Um, stream ones you can actually have checkboxes for screens and a drop down menu you have to set them up all individually for where you know youtube says um this is where your it provides an address and then a long two long addresses one for a backup you can drop that in there and youtube's changes always i think with twitch you can just maintain the same one anyway you set up the channels individually and then you use check to say start streaming here and start streaming here I think with Twitch it just whatever you're blasting out happens with YouTube you have to go in and say start this stream I haven't really worked with Twitch since uh, it was just a TV and was doing something for Destructoid and God, I guess uppity was the right name for comments <laughs> what time is it in Reno <coughs> Reno is in Pacific Standard Time it is 1107 right now uh, what's your opinion on Metal Gear Solid? Well, I did a video on number four where I explained my opinion on the previous three, um, and I haven't played, I haven't played Rising and uh, Metal Gear Solid Five that's coming out. I really didn't, and not show much interest there. Um, gamer guy asked that. Um, Beat says, YouTube comments are better. Uh, whenever I go to Twitch, everyone spams a bunch of pieces. <laughs> Seth Porter, Storm, what are you doing? Um, right now, I'm just taking comments. Because uh, uh, playing a game right now isn't really going to work if everybody wants to maintain their hearing in the future. If that short sentence was shorter, that would have been a whole lot more entertaining instead of, you know, I'm going to continue by, you know, end this sentence fast by speaking into the cup here. I'm uh, surprised I have gone through uh, more water. And that's how you execute it. Make the cup hit your glass. All right. Live boredom. Uh, beat, uh, beat JSRF says, okay, good, same time. So, I don't know. I really haven't settled on the time. The reason why uh, Sarah isn't bothering me right now, July 5th, it, she's got to work today. So, um, the, uh, the, the day I was thinking would be Saturdays uh, for live stream, but that's when it's usually happened. I decided about Ground Zero, says Seth Porter. I'm sorry, I haven't heard of it. This is where it'd be useful to bring back Josh. <laughs> Josh, Josh, he reads um, everything that happens in the gaming world. And so when I had him here for the Epic Mickey thing, which he brought over uh, the Xbox uh, 360 uh, disc, when we when he came over and did live stream, I was like, well, I don't know. And then we handed it over to Josh, and Josh has an intelligent opinion on everything. I'm just like, I need to bring him back. It, the thing is, our schedules are different, and I think that was a Memorial Day thing. I forget when we were on here, but uh, yeah, it was. We had the same day off, and so here he was. That was the night that Sarah got all pissed off and walked to downtown by herself, and got even more pissed off because I didn't notice because I was in a separate room listening to a game, talking to another guy. Yeah, that was an interesting night. Getting her to calm down. The crazy Evan, even. Sorry, I say it wrong all the time. So, hey, how's it going, y'all? Well, you got here just in time for us to continue a conversation. Uh, Enigma Extreme says, so Peach in a cat suit. Yeah. I forgot who I made the comment or commented back to was just like, my own personal cat woman. Uh, yeah. I mean, yeah. Naming conventions of one thing of Mario games Mario, uh, our full, our next 3D Mario being that isometric, um, I don't know, it, it, it's going to be funny because it's, it's Mario, but it doesn't look like it moves platforming forward much, and that's just because we've come to expect, we've come to expect Nintendo to make everything great. Uh, so, uh, and uh, Ryan Bryan asked, impressions of Sonic Lost World, it's a portal war, right? Uh. Let me, I'll let you guys know, the only uh, conference, E3 conference that I got to see, uh, because I've been working a lot, 
uh, which delayed videos a lot, um, it was the Sony one, and uh, I was like, yay. My, my, my funny comments about the, uh, the Sony conference was um, that they definitely won. Um, it, it was funny that we got into such a mindset where um, all this bad press was going out for, for Xbox was that uh, you can play your used games on uh, PlayStation 4. Lost our mind. Yeah! And um, you do not have to be connected all the time. I'm like, yeah, I was just like, wait a minute, that's kind of, that's kind of where we're at right now. That's what we... That's how our consoles are right now. You can play used games and you don't have to be connected all this time. It's just that we got so conditioned by this bad press coming in from Xbox that it was just sort of like, uh, Sony, save us! Um, and I read later on that uh, Xbox had dropped those restrictions, but I think it, like that's kind of late in the development cycle when it's going to be released this holiday, which I don't know. I didn't get, didn't get release dates on this, but um, can they go back into the design and change that real fast? Is that just a firmware update? Yeah. Uh, King Spark Seven E Three question mark Yeah, that's what I'm talking about right now. I've only saw one conference. Why are you still with your wife? She seems um, just. Uh, wait, 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 read this one. No one, uh, no auto. Okay, anyway, you know who you are. Why are you still with, with your wife? She seems like she just has more issues than worth dealing with. Well, now we're getting to uh, until death do us part. Yeah, I see what you're talking about, but um, deep down we do care about care very much for each other and it's you know we add depth to each other's lives here um there are a lot of happy times that i never mention like we, there's a water park here in reno called wild islands and she had a very good time there we can travel to lake tahoe she has a good time there it's just you gotta catch her at good times um when it comes to this gaming channel yes it is a hindrance but that's what <laughs> I don't know. It, it, I see it as a um, hyper extension of what I had before, which was when I started this, um, I'd get calls from my family every week, expect me to fix their problems. And so it was just like, great. Now they've that sort of laid off, or that has sort of gone away, and now I have uh, Sarah, my wife, who is a hindrance. But you know, I, I don't want to speak terrible about her because I do care very much. <laughs> so there we go. That's a great discussion here. I was talking about times that I should be doing live streams, and now we're talking about <laughs> until death do us part. All right. Um, I know the video will be out soon, but I love Catherine, and I would like to hear a quick thought about it. Well, um, I think you guys are going to be kind of disappointed um, on each of those points because... What is happening next is the oddities and treasures, which was kind of an idea I had the first time around in 2009, but didn't really get around to it because it was the middle of a, a series. Right now I'm in the middle of a million series. I mean, I haven't started those Dreamcast games that I got. But uh, the oddities and the treasures is going to be a quick rundown of all the games that, you know, didn't win first place or didn't trick you by saying Minecraft. It's uh, going to be a quick rundown of other games that sort of stood out. And with Catherine, basically the message there is going to be that video will happen as soon as Sarah can get over being nervous on camera and on a microphone. Because that's I really bought the game for her. Um, I had to play a lot of it for her when the puzzles, if you can call it that, got a little too difficult. And I was just playing it yesterday trying to build some stuff up to say, and God, I am so sick of climbing. It, it just didn't. Gameplay didn't change a whole lot. If you can even call it gameplay. Okay, there we go. That's my quick thought on Catherine. Uh, let's see. Is that about New Smash Brothers? Yeah, I am. Um, of course, it's, uh, you know, I've never been one to do a lot with, uh, um, you know, fighter games. And there you can start hating me. I, I formulate a sentence and call it Smash Brothers a fighting game. I really, I just thought it was really fun to play because it was a collection of Nintendo characters that I enjoyed playing. Uh, now we've gone way off of uh, the initial oh yeah here. Now we're talking about other crazy stuff going on. Uh, oh. oh, I saw a comment that I thought I would like to do. Uh, let's see, Google. 
how to side Google how to side like oh yeah yeah answer will be on the first page yeah and I got there and it was yeah, I didn't even need to do that because you know here we are side loaded um God this you need a new laptop yeah Kickstarter new laptop for me so I can do stuff and <laughs> stuff that sucks but not uh, where are they even going with that sentence I need water. Amazing Frog, you know what I, you know what I want. Amazing Frog, is that somebody who's talking here? Amazing Frog is a necessity. Oh God, you guys are referring to something that I don't know. <laughs> Seems to happen a lot. Anything new on the comments? We're still stuck on Catherine. Oh, 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 King Spark. Why do you hate Minecraft so much? Uh, is it that you like to be some sort of gaming hipster? No, it, I. My first impression of the game was seriously negative. I had no knowledge of a peaceful mode, and for the interest of continuing other projects, I'll just put Minecraft to the side. But of course, I mean, did you get that from the video where I explained my opinion of the game? It's fine, it's fine. I answered it right here. Uh, it's better format, and it's more intimate, and it's not scripted for where I, you know, if I script something, I don't write it, I type it up. And then, like, the hate seems to seep through further, further as I get to think about it more. And then it just comes out as, boom, all hate. So, um, by the way, when I recorded that, the Minecraft footage, what I did was I had actually just set up for my voice to go on it, and I recorded all 140 minutes of it. Except for the part where Sarah, you know, got pissed off and I had to, you know, pause, leave, go have an argument real fast, and then... Well, it wasn't a little fast. They came back, and I was really just sort of uh, play this game now. So, uh, and then she comes in at the end as I'm trying, as the last day is wrapping up on the game, and she comes in and says like, "This bitch," you know, she's referring to somebody on Facebook, as in like she sees that this person had commented on something that um, she had come across, but she has no not talked to her at all and. Yeah, that's a crazy mess there. So anyway, I plan on releasing that sometime when I get to editing it. Because I have to edit out the name of the person she's calling. Because I don't want that to go out. Another <coughs> thing. <coughs> Pardon. I have to edit still that skit that I filmed with Patrick. Of, of, of us, you know, doing... We, were, we just basically did a... Uh, What's the game even called? Skyrim, of course. The Skyrim skit. I have all the footage, just like the audio is ugh. The audio is ugh. As opposed to the audio that you heard when I was playing Goldeneye, which is ugh. Also, kids doing voiceovers in movies and games. That's that's the look I have there. Uh, Beat says, ah, Married Life. Crazy Evan, did Max Payne 3 get any votes uh, besides mine? Uh, I, don't, I don't remember that. I can look it up real fast. I don't... I think yours was the only vote. <laughs> um, but I guess to loop back on King Spark, no, I'm not trying to be some sort of game hipster. It's just... It didn't fall right with me. I guess that's the best way I can sum that up. Let's look at some more old comments while I'm waiting for new ones to come through. Everybody type something. Uh, how many viewers we got? Maintaining 26. That's pretty intense there. Storm, you should try playing Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate. And there you go. I read the comment. Mr. Total, not a biscuit. Makes me think of Total Halibut? Uh, the Cynical Brit, yes. I was introduced to those videos a while ago when my friend Daniel Porter, that's the last name, uh, I was visiting Sarah at some point when she lived in a separate state, you know, so, yeah, whatever. Um, I was visiting Daniel, and he was showing me all these videos by the single Brit, and we were like, ah, oh, that's funny, and he plays stuff on a PC, and he told me about a, uh, a series he had, ah, oh, jeez, I'm sweating so much, a series that he has called, uh, This is Why We Can't Have Nice Things, and I thought that was a really intelligent, uh, name for a series. Somebody had commented that I looked like a crack user in the last video. No response on why he thinks that. I mean, that's... Hopeful because that's like means I'm skinny or something. Okay, 
Uh, Enigma. The comments freeze. Ah, oh, they seem to be doing that. <laughs> the old dumpster. Type it, type, type, type. Something, something. Says computer literal vid gamer. Resident Evil Six. I haven't played it. That's told me. Say type something. Ask questions and through questions I can't even answer. Uh, I sent you a couple of Tomb Raider games. One being on the Dreamcast. Which oh, if I were to send you, which one would, would you review on them? Oh yeah, the Dreamcast. Yeah. I have, where are they, the Dreamcast games are right there. And so, of course, the next video is the Oddities and Treasures. It, it potentially could, probably could go really fast in the creation of it, but, you know, it's not. It's going to take a long time to do. Then after that, I'm not sure what I had uh, prepared. I think I was going to do the first Dreamcast game, which was Car Carrier. And then after that... I was going to intermingle it with... No, I don't know what I'm going to do. Because uh, by then, Grand Theft Auto V is probably going to be out. I'm about to be doing that live stream if they fix the driving. Uh, Skull X Crusher 56 Hey Storm, what do you think of the next generation? Excited? Concerned? Um, I'm excited. I guess the, the pricing... I don't know what to think about the pricing because we... We got this Extreme End, which was a PlayStation 3. Of course, that was six years ago. Well, now, now seven years ago. But inflation and cost, I don't know. Uh, the pricing seems to have settled in some sort of uh, a better range. I'm sad that um, we're, we're no longer in the era of Nintendo releasing this console for the same price uh, across like 15 years or whatever it was. Because wasn't the original Nintendo $200? So we're moving away from that. Uh, next generation, I am getting the feeling that uh, uh, Nintendo is kind of in a tight spot. They've always done this. They've always survived, even after even after being in uh, last place. Um, but it it depends on what your criteria for last place. Uh, it seems that uh, you know they no longer have something like the Wii Remote to carry them for a while with substandard graphics. Uh, now we got. I mean, I. When I heard 8 gigs for these next uh, consoles, I was just like, geez, we really need that much? And then, of course, that's another comment that's going to go into history as in, like, you know, 8 gigs? How'd you even live with that? Um, the games that are coming for it. Uh, it seems that PlayStation has, uh, um, I mean, they've recovered a lot. This is me speaking about corporations, like, I have any say in it, really. Uh, it seems like the PlayStation brand has come really around and uh, turn, turned this itself around since the uh, PlayStation 3 was launched, which was all bad press. And I told somebody that, uh, somebody had talked to me, and, uh, somebody I was working with, was talking to me about um, Xbox fixing the problems that they had talked about. I was like, oh, now we have no punching bag. Um, so we'll see how this plays out because it, it looks like as long as there's PlayStation 3 games being made, they could be ported over to the Wii U. <laughs> I'm really sad about that. That I was big and up about, like, the graphics, they're going to be great, and then it's just like, never mind, it's not even really being presented. Well, I'm always excited for Nintendo. I'll... Mario, Metroid, Zelda, I'll play them. Even if someday if they go to other consoles because they stop manufacturing hardware. Let's not go that far right now. Uh, so, I am excited for Next Generation. Who knows when I'll get those consoles because um, financial situation is kind of different than when I, uh, I got those other games. I got, I got everything else when I moved to Reno. I first had a job. I'm like, money in my pocket. Spend it. So, what have we been talking about? Thoughts on Wii Fit Trainer and Smash? <laughs> is that really happening? <laughs> I'm really out of here. Uh, Gaming Brit. A show says so Infamous Second Son, baby. Yeah, I'm actually I like Infamous, and um, the the well the graphical style is a little bit okay. It's better graphics, so it has more detail than the other Infamous games. But when you think about it, Infamous games have been quite detailed. But it seems like it's got the same attitude from what I've seen. And uh, shoot, Infamous looks like it's gonna continue being a good uh, good franchise. The total not a biscuit says the next gen consoles were given so much RAM so they could have extended along eighth console gen. Yeah, yeah, I, I, no argument here. Put you make your console however you want to make it. 
Um, middle man says, how's it going, Storm? It's all right. You know, I just stream with the Oya, oh, yeah, blowing up eardrums. <laughs> uh, Beat, has, has anyone sent you Jet Set Radio? No, I have not got Jet Set Radio. I gotta stop myself before I say something stupid. I think I played Jet Set Radio on the original Xbox. I think, you know, not that I, you know, put a Dreamcast game into the console. I played what I thought was, um, Jet Set Radio on the original, uh, original Xbox. Alright, well, this is where, this is the part of the stream where I'm losing a lot of steam. And, uh, so what I think it caught, got come out of, got out of our, uh, Q&A session, which ended when, uh, I was just like, alright, enough of this, uh, gaming, was that, um, I will attempt to stream to both uh, Twitch and YouTube. See how that goes. Timing uh, will be Saturdays. We'll try a weekly format. Um, no no real input on whether I should have that intro or not. I didn't read anything right there. Um, and the time, maybe a little bit later in the day, but I don't think anything later than 12 because, I don't know, I just, I just don't see uh, that working out, doing this preparation until 12 then a live stream, and then a lot of the day appears wasted to the uh, uh, the rest of the family. Word it like that. Uh, Ignite my stream. Yes, it's happening uh, as in Mega Man, the Villager, and Anita uh, from Anita, uh, Animal Crossing. Well, yeah, I know that Mega Man and Animal Crossing were happening. They, we, you, needs more diversity like Metroid, Star Fox, etc. It's funny that a uh, tech guy, uh, funny that we use that those for um, diversity. But I see what you're saying, because we got a Mario at launch. We're getting another Mario a year later, and we really haven't heard much on what would be happening for Metroid. Zelda, we, they, they tell us, and we'll see it at next E3, I predict. Let's see how my predictions go. What are my current predictions? 3DS Doer, um, uh, Marcus Phoenix gets a timeout. I don't know if that happened. Play, gotta play Judgment if that's truly what my prediction was. And, um, voiceovers in Zelda, yeah, so I'm waiting for the voiceovers because uh, we got to the point of emoting. And can, can Nintendo just ignore us for that long and continue to just neglect voiceovers? I mean, shoot, Nintendo Land had uh, a full voiceovers from, uh, I already forgot the screen's name. What was my other prediction? It was in the last video, God of War. Oh, right, that will get a game. The next God of War game will be during, um, will play out, you know, when he makes the deal with Ares, and who knows. Who knows if we're even getting any more God of Wars. I mean, I gotta wait for two more to come out to make another part to it, because that's how it's worked traditionally. Put myself kind of in a mess there. Uh, Metro Prime Online. Really? That'd be interesting. When people say stuff like that, I don't know if it's being totally serious, whether that's happening or any. Okay, well... We're up to 27 viewers, but I, I gotta stop this and uh, maybe play some more Goldeneye. Maybe clean up the house because that's just a nice thing to do. If you're here doing nothing, and by nothing I mean you're playing Goldeneye on an emulator, nothing, just nice to uh, get the house ready for when somebody comes home from work. It's truly her Friday and then the, our uh, weekend begins. And I actually gotta check into work. Let me just tell you guys that a lot of the delays that you have uh, experienced were not really related to the games or anything like that. It is my day job and I'm not complaining about the day job. I'd rather have a job than not have a job. Everybody got to experience the pain of when I was uh, um, unemployed. So um, let me explain that I am in the insurance industry and we have two big open enrollments. Open enrollments when you can change your coverage without a life event. A uh, big one is at the end of the year, and at the end of the year, well, I don't know how Obamacare is going because I think the restriction of, uh, uh, let's not get into the politics here, but anyway, end of the year is always a big time. Middle of the year is when a lot of other clients, will ch by clients I mean groups, would do group insurance, individual is a different thing, uh, but a lot of the group clients will do their open enrollment, and so uh, we got lots of enrollment, and it required a lot of weekend time, so um, I apologize that I have a job. I guess that's the best I can say there. 
So go ahead and play this thing back as soon as it ends. Uh, try to get my credit card information. And who knows, we might be able to... Uh, I guarantee there's not going to be a stream tomorrow. Um, because i got to get a new headset. But we might be able to start live streaming weekly um, next Saturday. So that's a prediction that I have on top of everything else. I'm not sure it's actually going to work. So thank you very much for watching, for maintaining uh, your bleeding eardrums while that was going. Um, I like the attendance numbers here. Higher than usual. And so I'm going to say stop streaming. I'm going to say yeah.